So if you're doing a retrofit installation and you're trying to minimize disruption to the property in regards radiator sizing, pipework sizing, you haven't got space for a hot water cylinder, then a hybrid could be suitable. Because with a hybrid, we don't need a storage cylinder, we have a combination boiler instead. But the boiler is also there to back up the heat pump, maybe in the depths of winter where it needs backup. So with a hybrid system, we'd still have our outdoor unit with our two pipes coming in to the indoor unit. The indoor unit is there where we then manage whether the heat pump produces central heating or whether the boiler produces central heating or maybe in the depths of winter where the heat pump needs support then the boiler will of course uh, assist. The hot water this time, instead of stored in a cylinder, is produced by a combi boiler, which we're all very familiar with. So here we have our flow from our outdoor unit, our return back to our outdoor unit. We then have the uh, flow from the boiler. We then have the return to the boiler. We then have a uh, pump to distribute the heat from outdoors uh, to indoors. We then have our um, PCB, where we have our, uh, our grey cable from, from our outdoor to our indoor unit. We then have our power supply. We then have a mixing valve. The mixing valve is there to regulate the temperature the boiler produces to maintain system efficiency.